Whoa. A huge city. I've yeah. I've never been anywhere like this before. Hey, there's too many people and it's super noisy. It is very noisy and it has a hard wine, time loading all these people. Wine, wine. <laughs> he would have helped me climb up on top of it. I think that's the windmill. Yeah, it's the windmill. Oh, it's really creepy looking. <laughs> it's not even a windmill. It'll kill us all. <laughs> I mean, really, I didn't even know that was a windmill when we first saw it. It was like, oh, a cool tower of some kind. I did just buy equipment somewhat recently, so we'll wait on armor. Let's take a look at the weapons, though. Oh. Ooh. <laughs> Double boost. We want them. Equip them all. Yeah. Notice, however, we're down to 48,000 gal. <laughs> oh, my God. We're halfway out of our money that we carried over. <laughs> Jeez, that is crazy. Yeah. Doesn't last forever in this game, but that's why we're not going just like, oh, buy everything. Because even with a head start, we're going to run out. Yeah. Nah. Nah. Yeah. Not worth it. Uh, well, we have a sub event over here. Two of them. If they're not voiced, then I'm not waiting around. Yeah. We to don't say. care about you. You look like just like the criminals on the wanted posters. Oh what? no! <laughs> you actually recognize this? You can get over it later. Run away! <laughs> All right, good. Thank goodness. We ran away from that baby child. Yeah. Gotta wait for everybody to load in. Got my cargo again. Wipe out some monsters. Yeah, I'll do it. That's easy. If you, if you die, I'll have someone pay for your funeral. Fantastic, sir. Wow, sir. I'm almost offended. Oh. Actually, I'm very <laughs> offended. And okay, wagon. I wasn't kidding. <laughs> this is a place I come to a lot, especially in Zillia 2. This was yeah. like my hub because it's the closest signboard to warp in location. Yeah. So you get used to the loading in. It doesn't shock you anymore. But it's been a while, so I was like, oh. Shelton sure is nicer than it is in Ajul. Did you come here from Ajul? We did. We came in through Sapstrath Sea Haven. Well, good on you for making it all this way. I bet going through that checkpoint wasn't much fun. No, it really it sucked. Wasn't that bad. Okay, we never mind. Used to be able to trade with Ajul freely, but now with all these new regulations, it's almost impossible to do business. I've heard things are getting weird at Fort Gandala too. I hear they're working on some kind of big-time spirit art. You think it's for war? It could well be. Between Rashigal and Ajul? But why? I'm sure you've seen how the king of Rashigal has been consolidating power around himself. No. <laughs> While on the other hand, the king of Ajul is some great hero who united all of the tribes by force. Two strong rulers and two neighboring countries. It's only natural they'd start bumping against each other. There have been skirmishes, but we haven't had open war since the Battle of Fezabel 20 years ago. Hey, this could be the business opportunity of a lifetime. <laughs> Let's take advantage of the war and Yay. chaos. War is good for business. <laughs> yeah, sad but true. First ones to die. Yeah, you're right. These new inspections have been pretty devastating to our business already. Hey, don't let it get you down. War isn't a certainty yet. War, huh? What is it good for? Absolutely nothing. <laughs> When he says war and then a huh. Yeah, it's like you're just asking for is, that song is, to start playing in the background. The huh is basically huh. Yeah. <laughs> so, yeah, it's James Brown. It's happening. Yeah. No arguments. Also, we had two different members of Critical Role in that cutscene. <laughs> Five of the seven main ones are in this game. Oh, that's fun. Hi, ma'am. Not another one. Nothing but portfolios of men that she wants me to marry. <laughs> Great. Okay. We'll take it. Sunglasses. Yeah, we already have those, of course, like everything else. I'm pretty sure we have all the attachments in this game, but um, we could buy food real quick since we're here. I mean, we can't let Mila starve. That is just no. rude. Terrible performance. Yeah. <laughs> oh, but food's expensive at this point. That's true. <laughs> oh, God. Well, these will pay for themselves, though, especially the galled ones. So we'll do it. Goodbye, money. <laughs> Goodbye, we don't my need money. You. Goodbye, my friend. <laughs> Plus, the more points the food vendor gets, the cheaper the food gets. Yeah. All right, so we have all the ones that we care about. Experience, Gowd, and experience in Gowd. <laughs> <laughs> I 
Very nice. I think we, we have our priorities oh, yeah. straight. Plus, considering how long some of these last, we really shouldn't need to buy food again for a while. Yeah. So it's an investment. It'll pay off. Yeah. Are you nervous about something? No. No one's ever asked me over for tea before. Oh. I'm a bit excited. Oh, that's so cute. Tea party. People were like, no, but then it turned out to be cute. So you're like, okay, I'm on board. <laughs> yes. Yes. <laughs> but no. We've been waiting for you. Star Fox. <laughs> Andros has ordered us to take you down. Wow. You live here? It's quite lavish. Please Hello. don't hurt us. We are guards and also lions. <laughs> Wait. Who, what on earth are you wearing? I too am a lion. You can see where we get the designs from. <laughs> really inspired, I think. Into the coach. Oh, thank God they didn't see us. Who was that? Have our guests departed? Good thing you didn't come here sooner for tea. That would have been awkward. <laughs> then we would have fought everyone who was a lion. <laughs> who are you? You look like Welcome her brother. Back. Brought your friends, I see. <laughs> uh. Let me introduce you. Oh, um, I never got their names. Whoops. <laughs> yeah, that's awkward. I hear you came to my sister's aid. I'm Klein Cheryl. I'm Drissel's older brother, as you've no doubt guessed. Yeah, yes. I can tell because of your hair. Yes. It's asymmetrical really? and goofy. How rude of us to keep you waiting outside. Please, let's continue our conversation in comfort. Don't poison the tea. I never know how to say his name. Kyle Haber? Hebert? Oh, Hebert. I think it's Hebert, but I also say a Hebert sometimes, like without thinking, so I don't know either. I think that's him. I think it's Hebert. His voice has oh. also been in a couple other little NPCs, but I'm pretty sure this is him as well. Yeah. I gotta listen I for see. it again. So you protected my sister from wasting her money on worthless trinkets again. It's not worth It's like a higher pitched Kami now. Kind of. Kind of. A less boring <laughs> Ryu. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Look at my beautiful braid. Do you know how many years it took for my hair to grow this long? After our guests, it would be my pleasure, sir. Twenty years. <laughs> I have some matters to attend to, if you will excuse me. Also, look at that little tuft of hair on. Uh... Huh? Okay, never mind. I better leave now before things get messy. Okay. <laughs> Alvin's like, perfect. Now so I can ship them. You, right? you simply must tell me all about your travels. Sure. Mm, well, We've almost died multiple times. I've never even been out of this town. I want to hear all about the faraway places you've been. Hamil sucked. I've never been outside either. But then, Ellie became pals with Jude and everyone. We crossed mighty oceans and explored forbidden forests. We saw giant waves and toadstools that made everyone cry. You actually sailed across the sea, Ellie? I've never even seen the sea before. What was it like? How are we getting this trope twice? <laughs> yes. <laughs> dangerous creatures. There are giant octopuses pretending to be rocks. Isn't, Rock oc isn't it octopi? Both. Oh, okay. So both are correct then. And eels mm -hmm. and clams. Interesting. Oh, I've seen clams. Uh, the shells anyway. They sell shell jewelry in the shops in the plaza. It's all so gorgeous. That sounds really nice. I'll give you one of my favorite pieces as a present next time. As a token of our friendship. That's nice. Good. Go be friends with her and Maybe and clams just only friends with her. Jewelry? This I gotta see. So giving presents is a way to establish friendship? What was that? Why, yes. Did you see that? It's fine. There was a green a sparkle in the screen. Mm -hmm. Did no one really see that? Also, Mila was riding an invisible motorcycle. What? Getting stuff for free doesn't stink either. 
I see. You can't see your hands now. It would appear my oh. mistress has made some very good friends. Make yourselves at home. Oh, yeah, I was going to mention Rowan's hair. Treats. Look at that. The yeah. little bing. This is not a default costume for him. Spoiler alert, he's a party member. But oh, I think yeah. it's his best look by far. I don't even... Oh, I, I kind of remember what the default looks like. It's not as good as this. This is much more snazzy. I've been in the service of Lord Klein for about two years now. He is a fine ruler, despite his youth. He believes in freedom and equality for his people. If he has any real flaw, it's that he spoils Lady Dressel too much. All right. Oh, okay. He disappeared for a second. Yeah, they're all having to go back in. Teleporting powers. It's crazy. You can't take your eyes off these things. You that into antiques? No, not particularly. I'm simply fascinated by the illogical proclivity of humans to apply an abstract concept like beauty to everyday objects. That's, a uh, pretty deep. I've also been thinking about our current predicament. There's something to be said for hiding in plain sight, but we should not tarry here for long. Yeah, we shouldn't overextend our stay. They've been so good to us already. There's also a bird in that cage. Kill it! Talk to bird. Dang it. We are incapable of speaking with the bird. They do move slightly, though, which is nice. Yeah. All right, who else do I have to talk to? Notice that Elise is not one of them. Thank <laughs> God. Um, Head out once you've rested up. Okay, well, we got to talk to people first. There's story things happening. Come on. Yeah. Really? Nothing? These okay. doors. <laughs> Time to steal everything. Yeah. We got to check under the mattress. Oh, Kevin, Dang we it. have something, but nothing. This isn't the old people's room. We got to find the old people's room. Then we'll find the money. You know, this makes sense, though, because fancy people have people who clean up for them. So there's not going to be anything under the bed or uh, you're right. folded into a corner. Unless they hide it under their bed. Like the maids steal it from their masters. And then, yeah, I don't know why they would do that. But, you know, greedy Gusses. Yes. Yes. Greedy Gusses and greedy Gus Gus. Yes. Nope, wrong way. <laughs> All true. All right, so I think I have to try to leave. Klein, why the unfriendly face? Whoa, okay. Teleported out of nowhere. I'm afraid I can't permit you to leave just yet. Oh. I know it was you who infiltrated the laboratory in Fenmont. How did you find out so soon? Probably Mila's hair gave it away. Look at that. <laughs> <laughs> She's not impressed. <laughs> what are you talking about? Save your denials. Alvin told me everything. Uh, what? What? Now That's what? rude. Will you hand us over to the military? No. I want to know what you saw in that facility. Rashigal has undergone dramatic changes ever since Noctigal exceeded the throne. Even those of us in the six ruling houses are not told of his activities. The military is holding people captive and draining their mana to develop a new weapon. Human experimentation? He would go that far? I'd like to oh, believe you're lying. We're gonna get his help, but that's nice. Fit. So Nautical is the man behind the experiments? The king of Rashigal? He would have to be. It's hardly hospitable to keep Drissel's friends captive in our home. But you must leave this city at once. Thank you, Lord Klein. Yeah, don't mention it. <laughs> hey, you can be Elise. Oh, God, no. Barfity barf. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> but you can't link with Mila. Oh, I can't? No, nope, because I'm her. Oh, right. Okay, that, that's fine. That's okay. All right. Um, find Alvin. Let's go beat him up. Yeah, punch him in the also, face. Also, excuse me, Jude. I know this is Jude's story, but you cut that out. <laughs> <laughs> Drissel's house sure is huge. Yeah, this might be bigger than my entire school. Maybe? I don't know. Is your entire school just one building, or is it all the buildings? Sheraton's Plaza. Looks like some of them are your age. Why not try to talk to them? 
All right, sub event. Oh my God, we're gonna force her to I make truly friends. The dedication of these centuries to their mission, but if they stand in my way, I will have no choice but to cut them down. Yeah, you hear that? That's pretty intense. That's me. Yeah. I'll kill you. Yeah. Meanwhile, Slash your throat. Here's one of the least favorite oh things in the game. Oh God. You were so pink and cute. We look exactly the same. Super cute. We are clones. What? <laughs> God, what even? Elise, you're not wrong. Look at that stance. That is the stance of terror. <laughs> I was just wondering, what the heck are they talking about? You don't have to be scared. They're just children. Go on and ask them. <laughs> Why does he sound like an alien ship? Um, woosha, woosha, woosha. What's the cute pink thing you're talking about? You are spying on us. We have okay. Well, that escalated quickly. Wow. Super nothing. Wow. Whoa. That weird thing talked. What is it? Like super weird. Ugh. He's not weird. He's Tipo. Tipo? Well, whatever. I'm still not going to show the cute pink thing to someone like you. Fine. Ah, fooey. But... If you can show us that you love the color pink, what? And prove you're a true pinkist. I may consider it. Prove I'm a pinkist? How? God, this sounds awful. Point. Now we're delving into feminine pink. stereotypes. Rare things that are pink. For example, start with the peach berry blossom. Bring us one of those, then we'll talk. <laughs> we'll super talk. Oh my god, shut up! <laughs> I warned you! That was terrible! You don't happen to have one of those, right? Super after. <laughs> <laughs> I'll show you something pink. Yeah, oh no! Okay, no! <laughs> Super pink. Oh, I'm not in front. <laughs> Super pink! Whoa! <laughs> god. I actually do like the Tebow follows her around. I didn't notice that before. Yeah. That's, that, that's cute. Okay, Even that's enough of that. Awful. <laughs> For a half second there, you trusted me on that. That was fun. <laughs> you really should have known better, but. <laughs> All right. Because uh, I was like, oh, the other one is pink in it. And then, like, no. A little, but it's mostly brown. Yeah. That, the however, is, purple. <laughs> is pink. In yeah. What little material there is. Uh, <laughs> ugh. Oh, Japan. Bird. Alvin! Kill him! Kill him with him. fire! And a stupid dove! We found him. It wasn't hard. This is really freaking easy. He sticks out like a sore thumb. Yes. Especially in this outfit. The <laughs> other one kind of blends in. Yeah, definitely uh, not camouflaged here. Hi, I didn't sell you out. <laughs> yeah, thank you. Tattletail, you jerk! You, you tattle jerk! Tebow, stop. How much did you <laughs> That is beautiful. Sell you out? Such an ugly phrase. Money isn't the only currency, you know. It's no secret that Lord Klein is unhappy with the current government. If we want info, we have to give some in return. It's called a trade. I told him what I know, and he gave you some juicy info in return, right? I mean, I guess, but if we maybe talked about it first, it would have been better. Man responsible for everything. So long as he remains alive, he could construct a second or third Lance of Kresnik. You're going to assassinate the king? What choice do I have? I can't allow him to continue, even if his death throws your country into chaos. Dang, that is intense. I suppose it's the lesser of two evils. We can't let him keep sacrificing innocent people for their mana. Oh no! Oh no! <laughs> <laughs> Now everybody notices us. And Great. Hey, you're the people from the wanted poster. Whoops. That little I kid ratted sure us out. That wasn't the smartest idea. Mm. Wind from the southwest. Two meters per second. A nice breeze. Rowan, why are you talking about the breeze right now? Not a good time, buddy. Please, allow me to handle this. But you're too old. Hey, Step out of the way before you break a hip. Oh, that's offensive. I mean, I know I just called them old, but... Oh, dear me. What a fearsome trio. A bit on the sloppy side, though. 
You two in the rear. Isn't your formation a little wide? If you stand so far apart, how will you help your comrades in a moment of crisis? Shut up! Like we need your tactical advice. And you, good sir, aren't you standing a little too far forward? From there, you might be able to catch me. But the good people behind me, on the other hand... Hmm. Now, the knives yeah, have been in the air for, like, 30 seconds. How high did he have to throw them? Yeah, what the... Now, if you'll excuse me. Everyone, please follow me. I really thought the knives were going to stab them in the head, but nope. that's pretty violent, so... That's a little hardcore for Rowan. A little bit. <laughs> Rowan? That was awesome! You sure showed those meanies! Dear me. You misused the word awesome. It was merely a delay tactic. Whatever it was, you saved us, uh, Mr. Rowan. Just Rowan is fine. What do you need from us? My, get right to the point. Indeed, I have a favor to ask of you. Of us notorious criminals? This can't be good. The King of Rashagal came to the manor earlier and ordered our citizens be drafted into service. What? That's messed up. Nocturgo was here? Yes. The man you saw leaving by carriage earlier was King Noctogal himself. Whoa, seriously? The Lion guy. Mm -hmm. Why is he forcing people into his service? Maybe he needs more experimental subjects? My master couldn't abide seeing his people in danger. He set off to rescue them. But Noctogal is not one who takes disobedience lightly. Is Dracel's brother in danger? Undoubtedly. And I wish to rescue him. Will you assist me? Any brother of a pal is a brother of mine! Right, Ellie? We can't turn a blind eye at this point. We should help. Here we go again. For an honor student, you sure are lousy at learning lessons. It's settled. We cannot allow Noctical to proceed with any plan that involves using that weapon. There's your answer. You have my thanks. The people were taken to Bermia Gorge. We must make haste. Let's do it then. All right, time to go kill I some people. Curry, but it always ends up getting stuck on my mustache. The mustache or the Mabo Curry? I have to pick one. It's a decision I've struggled with for over a decade now. <laughs> you so, and your first world problems. He just joins Rowan. the party. He's immediately like, you know what I like about curry? And you're like, <laughs> what? Whoa, okay, buddy. What? Anybody else get a level? So it's just Rowan who's got the points then. Um. Uh. I'll do this real quick. I will not turn on auto. I'm not a horrible monster. Yeah, we're never doing that again. He's not going to join the party, unfortunately. I'm not surprised. His current constitution means that I'm not going to play as him. And we're not taking out Jude and Mila. Definitely and not. That would be a sin against nature. Not taking out our healer, so... <laughs> Spirit's pretty good for him. March Waltz. Remember that? I do remember that. Blum, blum. <laughs> Does it still do that in this game? I don't remember. Mm. I don't think so. I feel like if it did, I would remember, but maybe I just didn't <laughs> notice because we barely played. Like, nobody really played Rowan at all. Yeah, that's a true. A few different people changed at certain points. Like, I traded between Alvin and another character. Nobody really ever played him significantly. Yeah. I think maybe Sean did until he realized the majesty of Mila's lightning that's spam. That's correct. So, other than that, I don't think he... Uh, yeah, I don't think anyone else good. really did. Take a reduction and we'll expand again. And the flower continues to bloom. The flower, it grows. 10% <laughs> chance of zero TP cost. Seems neat. Yeah. Too bad we'll never take advantage of it. Not true. Never. Okay. <laughs> but. <laughs> He's too old. And all he cares about is curry. He is not qualified to fight. <laughs> Air pressure. It's not uh. healthy. 
So we're going to go around the horn, get this assault too, and then get air pressure, expand it again. And we'll be almost out of points, so we can continue on this game, I heard. Yeah. I reckon. <laughs> but we'll do it the fast way. Ladies and gentlemen, when you're going to fill in two squares at once, you always want to save that spot for last. It's a faster way to menu. Yeah. This stuff matters for speed runs. Yeah. God, I can't even imagine somebody trying to do a speed run, really, of any RPG, especially big ones like this. Like, Yeah, how? I don't know. I don't know how you do that. It's a similar problem with the games that have not been glitched out heavily, like Zelda games. So, like, yeah. Ocarina of Time can be beaten in, like, 15 minutes now because they've found ways to just break everything. And there's... You turn, like, bottles with bugs in them into weird warp yeah. points inside Ganon's <laughs> Tower and blah, right. blah, blah. Yeah. Um, so you can beat that in, like, 15 minutes. So if you have a, you know, a suboptimal run, then 15 minutes isn't, like, a chunk of your life. Wind Waker's record is something like four hours, I think. Yikes. Which is really quick for Wind Waker. Right, right. But, that's but still... it's still four hours. Yeah, and especially because you have to go so fast. Like, it takes the fun out of it in a way. If there's any, like, one frame tricks in there or anything that involves luck, then all of a sudden that can really suck to get, you know, three hours into a good run be on a record pace and then have something just jack you up and be like, well, there's three hours of my life gone. Yeah, exactly. And then you have to start over. That's the worst part to me. Because, I mean, we lost a part of the recording. I had to play that part of the game again. And that wasn't much fun, but it also wasn't like, ugh. Yeah. Wasn't the worst. 